I'm Frankie Andrea, and we're rolling with the tour presented by VisitCalifornia.com. I'm here with Mr. Jelly Belly. So as you can see, we are at the headquarters in Fairfield, California for Jelly Belly Jelly Beans. But let's go inside the factory and find out a little bit more. Well, and this is the epicenter where all the Jelly Bellies are made. I'm here with Stephanie Scott, event marketing manager for Jelly Belly. Tell me a little bit about uh, about the factory tours, that people actually can come in and see how the Jelly Bellies are made. Well, welcome to Jelly Belly. Thank you. It's great to have you here. Uh, this is really where all the magic happens. People come from all over the world to learn how we make Jelly Belly beans, and they really can see the process from start to finish. Tell me a little bit about uh, the Jelly Belly name and where uh, originally the Jelly Bellies uh, came from. So Jelly Belly Candy Company was founded as uh, Golitz Confections in uh, 1896. Uh, it is still family owned and operated. The fourth, fifth, and sixth generation are still very actively involved in, in the process here. And uh, in about 1986, we built this particular facility, started giving tours not there long thereafter, and uh, have done some refreshes, and we just did a really great refresh last year on the tour program. So it's all new, a lot more interactive and technology, and it's just a ton of fun. I've seen you guys sponsor uh, air races, uh, dragsters, obviously the cycling team, the longest running U.S. Uh, domestic sponsorship. Uh, tell it, what does it mean for Jelly Belly to be part of Amgen Tour of California? What does that mean? Well, it's always been a great uh, privilege and a pleasure to be part of the race. I know the guys are really, really excited this year, uh, particularly with the step up to the World Tour status. Uh, I spent some time with them last night. I know they're really, really excited to be to just get the racing started. Yeah, definitely. Uh, obviously, sport beans a big part of the, their racing nutrition. Uh, but all of the Jelly Bellies, uh, they're fat free, they're gluten free, they're some are sugar free. Mm -hmm. uh, tell me a little bit the different products that Jelly Belly makes. Well, we make about 150 different kinds of candy. Well, let's not go through all those. No, then. there's a hundred of them that are Jelly Belly beans, and then we do a lot of other uh, candies like Mellow Creams. We do uh, marshmallows, flavored marshmallows. Uh, we have licensing agreements. We do Sun Kiss Fruit Gems, Sport Beans. Uh, the Big one is Bean Boozled. That's the one everybody wants to try. That's the one I was going to ask you about. What's the worst that, in your experience, what do you think is the worst on Bean Boozled? I had spoiled milk last year. That was one of the new flavors we launched, and uh, my boss tricked me into trying it, and it was dreadful. It was spot on. I told him, you know what? We're done. We've got it. We nailed it. <laughs> so who's going to be brave enough to be Bean Boozled? Stephanie, thank you very much. You're I'm Frankie Andreas. We're rolling with the tour presented by VisitCalifornia.com.